Welcome to another Take Crazy News Headlines. Now people, this vlog today is all about the war. What's going on in Mountain View, Rockford, especially between Hills and Basewan. Almost more than a week now, there will be intense gun battle between Basewan men and men from Hills. Warwicka Hill to be exact. And so far, my viewers, subscribers, innocent persons have been killed in this ongoing battle. Now, this war now go on, I start fresh now. It has been happening for quite some time now. But there was a calm, but now the war start up back between Base 1 and Hills. And people, it's a worrying trend in Rockford, Mountain View overall, because right now, these two wine factions one join other communities such as giant lane other communities in the area and to be honest with you people we can't afford these things to spite the control because if giant lane enter this war you know mountain view done for and you know during these times different communities in mountain view put together and actually hold treats for the children so the kids will be suffering right now. People are on the edge in both these communities. People can go to school, people can go to work, people are living in fear. And my viewers and subscribers, this is a worrying trend for many factors. Many factors, family, relatives and friends. And you know, Mountain View overall is known for violence over the years. We are talking about political violence, violence of a community project, different kinds of violence, even, you know, disrespect violence. So the least thing can trigger about violence in Mountain View and Rockford overall. And just by going back and forth between world different rival communities can spark back that long-standing feud, that long-standing first for gun battle between rival communities is no causing problem no. You see base one and Warwicka Hill aka Hills is actually at war right now and they are trying their best to draw in Jared Lane. But what I can say right now to Jared Lane remain focused stay out of the war because it's not a problem it's going to actually bring highlight more on mountain view because once Jared Lane get in that war other communities such as even Burr Gully actually going to go in that war other communities as well to mention Backbush as actually an that next dangerous community so we can't afford that to happen in Mountain View, Rockford right now. Now the killing of Red Bull, actually the latest killing between Base One versus Hills War. Now Red Bull is from Base One and he was killing New Kingston, Santers. So you see how far the money may go? If you take out people from rival communities of Base One and Hills, you see how far they may go? People, this war is not pretty. Because most of the victims so far are men. And most of them are innocent. They are not gang members. But because they come from communities, base one and hills who are beefing right now. They are targeted and they are taken out. Now right now there are curfew in these areas. But the curfew can't stop the beef between Base one and hills, you can't stop it. Now, since the exposure of Dogman, seen by your screen right now, and his organization, who are called the Mortal Gang, and exposing the victims, innocent victims, they have killed. They are now uncomfortable. 
they're actually worrying and they're scared because they don't know what's the next move of the security forces. So basically, they're in hiding right now, playing hide and seek. This is what we love in our people. When we expose criminals and make them uncomfortable. Because they think that they are so invincible. Because they have their guns. When you shine that light on that cockroach, they eventually seek other places to hide. I said this once and I'll say it again. Cockroaches do damages in the dark. Once you turn on that light and apply that insect spray to that cockroach, they eventually die. This is what happens to criminals. They do their dirty deeds in the dark. Once you expose them, they get complacent and they get worried, very uncomfortable, and they seek other places to hide. Once pressure is applied to them, they eventually give up. No zombie is Dogman's number one killer, yeah man. He has committed a lot of murders so far and not been held accountable. So JCF, you need to catch him. And this youth will not go down without a fight. He's not gonna go to jail, he will fight until the very end. So be prepared. Now the screen right now is Javi Smith, who I mentioned in the previous video. Now a picture, in, picture of him, but now a picture of Javi Smith. He's also a dangerous youth as well. And he committed a murder, double murder, with Dada Boy, yeah man, of killing Ian and Steve Lynch in 2019. So the next one you have to get rid of ASAP. This is Jay Crazy News once again. Until then, bless up. Yeah man, I'm here see a black legend. I'm here represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So what? Like, comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy not play with him and review the thing then. Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. In review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. Jay Crazy not play with him and review the thing then. Review the thing them, review the thing them Check crazy Reviewing news, entertainment and celebrity lifestyle Review the thing them, review the thing them